The German Grand Prix was a, was a good one. You know, I, I qualified well. The race was, was a little bit disappointing because at Turn 1 I had a, almost had a coming together with Sebastian Vettel and I had to back off the throttle. Lost three places down into Turn 2. Got two of them back and finished fifth, so not a bad result. We didn't have the pace of the Red Bulls and the Ferraris, which is a little bit disappointing. But moving on to Budapest, I think uh, you know, we have some good improvements, so I'm looking forward to that. This season is, you know, it's so competitive. You know, Ferrari and Red Bull and us have, have all been competitive, you know, for, for most of the season. But it's when you put the package on your car, when you put the update on your car, and there have been some pretty big updates going on cars. Ferrari had a big one for the last race in Germany, and they made a good step forward. We had one in Silverstone, which we didn't quite get the full benefit out of it at Silverstone. I think we did a little bit more in Hockenheim, and I think we will again in Budapest. Maybe we haven't had the quickest car most of the year, but we've done the best job. And, you know, we're, we're leading both championships. Lewis is first and I'm second, so we're, we're doing okay. The Hungara Ring is a very tough circuit. It's quite bumpy. Uh, it's a slow speed circuit, but mentally it's very draining because it's just corner after corner. You don't really, you don't really get any rest. I think we, we should say that our chances are good, you know, we need to be positive. Hockenheim wasn't the perfect race for us, uh, but we were fourth and fifth, so not far off the podium. So I think coming here we should be looking for a podium finish, definitely. Lap records don't really mean anything to me, you know, for me it's about that weekend, not what happened a previous season, for example, so winning the race is the most important thing. And, if you, if you get the quickest lap time, that's great as well. There's always the possibility that you can get hurt in, in motor racing. It's a dangerous sport. But every day that we race, the cars are getting safer and safer. And the uh, FIA and also the GPDA are working as hard as we can and all the teams to make sure that we're, we are producing safer circuits and safer uh, cars. The first person would probably be your chief engineer, you know, that's the guy that you've worked closely with that whole weekend and you want to celebrate with the whole team and also your friends and family. I don't really have a home at the moment, we travel so much that it's very difficult. But this is a part of my life where I know that's, that, that's the way it is, you know, I'm travelling, I'm, you know, everything is based around my work at the moment and my hobbies. So. It's completely understandable that I don't really feel like I have a home. But technology is helping a lot. I'm using my phone as much as I can to keep in touch with friends, family and also my girlfriend. Also, I've got the new iPhone so um, I can use Skype on the iPhone which is great.